It's been two months after torrential rain ravaged Mandia Primary School. Located 40 kilometers southwest of Livingstone in a remote part of Kazungula district, the school is attended by over 500 pupils. It is said to be the only primary school within a 10 kilometer radius. Now that part of its infrastructure lies in ruins, management at the school is struggling to address the situation. School head teacher Fred Kashweka has again appealed to government and stakeholders for assistance in the rehabilitation of the three by one classroom block. Uh, we are quite in a, in a problem like we mentioned last time. Uh, as you can see around, this building here, one by three, which, has, which was blown off. Uh, so as it now, as you can see around, people are just roaming about. Some parents who convened for a parent-teacher association PTA meeting are grieved over the dilapidated state of the school. We live in the school. We have only made before classrooms in the So they are sharing. We have to be able to get the school for 12 hours. So to pay for that, but to turn this man into my classrooms, you. If we are going to my classroom, so we are going to have to move, move, move. If we are not classy, we are not able to go to the school. We are going to have to move. If we are going to have to move, we are going to have to move. If we are going to have to classroom. And school head boy, 18-year-old Richard Hanongo, and his fellow pupils equally expressed concerns on their welfare. Apa no wuchushe poburi wakwe watinga tule sambilira sota kuli kusambilira wino mwone ne na kusambilira wino tapari ta tule sambilira yu mkuhonsefe tule ikarafi. Likupate mtuwewe esko unawewa muna urkena wa matende. Sofa yu narukena nga fuku mwalusi yanga libuka libuka za kolo wanga wuzi yanga fafasi babamu. Tulambuwa ni mtu ya kile chiko chiko je sulifide tu hilo matente. Kutukwa sika mbula tulateta mabuwa ya teta tuwenka unganda kuchitako ya nika amulilo. Following the collapse of the 3x1 classroom block, this small tent is the only help the school has received from government and it is undisputable that this tent is far from mitigating the problem, especially when it rains. Schools have opened, but the situation here at Mandia Primary School is appalling on the pupils' performance due to less learning infrastructure, as it can be seen by these ruins. This matter therefore begs immediate government intervention. Clive Kalung, Movie TV News. In Mandia, Southern Province.